Our next guest has been with her man for 18 years, and they have four kids together. She says she even planned a wedding once, but her boyfriend left her standing alone at the altar. Adrian, come on out. down that aisle well. Thank you. What is it like walking down the aisle to the wedding music? Oh, that was my first time doing it. It was? <laughs> yes. Tell me about the time you planned a wedding. We planned the wedding. My family was there, the children was there, the preacher, everything was there except for Henry. Now when you say we planned the wedding, not you and Henry. All right, me and my mother planned the wedding. Oh. But Henry went and got fitted for his tuxedo. Oh, he did? He went and got fitted for his tuxedo. Did he give you an engagement ring? Yes. He gave you the engagement ring, yes, too? but he never proposed to me. So how did you get the engagement ring? He gave me the engagement ring more like to, to be quiet, to, yeah. you know, calm So me down. did you just inform him one day, I'm planning a wedding? No, I begged Henry to marry me. Yeah. And then he said, OK. And I guess at the last minute, he backed out. You were at the, how far did you get into the wedding before you realized he was It was like, there? what, 15 minutes before the wedding started? Yeah. Henry had came to, he came to the church, he got my brother, and they left. He? He came to the church. He came to the church? Uh-huh, and then left. And took your brother? Took my brother with him and left. Wait, wait, wait. Where did they go? They went to hang out for what he tells me. They went to just go hang out and chill. Why would your brother leave your wedding with him? My brother feels that I shouldn't be degrading myself, begging a man to marry me. All right. I agree with that, Adrian. I agree with that, but I still don't understand how he helps that along by le leaving with him to the, to the... Yeah. So was that not embarrassing? It was embarrassing. It was hurting. You, you know, had a it, church full of people, didn't yes, you? Yes, I did. My Can whole... you imagine that my moment? My kids was even sitting there disappointed. That has got to be mortifying. How did you all get back together after that? Well, I left him for about a year. And yeah. he's a good father, so he would always come see the kids on, like, the weekend and come yeah. by when he got his check to make sure the kids had everything that they needed. Okay. So by seeing each other and him spending the weekends with the kids and we spent time together, that's how we mm -hmm. got back together. You... I really love Henry. It's just that I can't, you know, keep putting myself out there. I got to move on. I'm getting older. How old and are I, you? I'm 32. Get out. <laughs> really? Yeah. And I got to move on. Well... You ready to tell Henry that today? Yes, I am. All right, Henry, come on out. Uh, Henry, thank hey. you for coming out today. What's up? What's going on, y'all? You, 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 I'm ready for you, Henry. <laughs> I'm ready. You went and got fitted for your tuxedo. Well, you let the wedding progress, I assume. You didn't hold up your hand and say, stop this, because you went to get fitted for the tuxedo. You went to the, to the church the day of the wedding, got her brother, and left? Well, um, I really w didn't want to get married anyway, because I told her that before. And her and her mother got the money together, and they planned everything, so I just didn't show up. Now, Adrian, you know? did he tell you he did not want to get married? Yes, he, he, he still tells me now he doesn't want to get married, but um, I got to move on with my life. I mean, it's just like I'm standing still. I'm not going anywhere. Do you feel nowhere. as if the problem has been... Um, wait, what? She ain't going nowhere. We go through this every year. Every, every year, man. She ain't going nowhere. But we for me not to be year. going nowhere, for me not to be going, I was packing this morning. I was packing my clothes. He going to go in his closet and say, here, don't forget your makeup case. No, but but we go through this all the time. And, and the reason why I told I'm not going to marry her, because but if, if you're I not going to marry her, me, let me move I'm marrying on. her let mother, her brother. I'm marrying her whole family, because she can't go one day without talking to him. Everything that's gone in our life, um, her whole family me. knowing. Sir, Everything. I think you are very wrong and disrespectful to that beautiful woman sitting next to you. I take care of her. What you talk about? But you saying she's but, not going nowhere? I do You're everything for her. You're definitely not going nowhere she with just... that attitude. She's going to walk away and find her a real man. I'm a real man. <laughs> now, 